Hey guys, what's up? It's Brandon here, and today I'm going to be talking about the Modern Warfare Remastered and kind of give a little review about it. Alright, so I kind of want to hit some key topics right now, like one of them being, should it be worth buying with Infinite Warfare? And my answer is yes, because I think it is a very, very good bonus, essentially for only like 20 more bucks, um, 20 or 30 more bucks. And I think that's well worth its price, especially for those people who are original COD players and love the older Call of Duties like myself. For the most part, the gameplay is very, very smooth, except when you bump into people. Like old Call of Duty games, when you bump into people, you can't move anywhere and it makes the game kind of glitchy. That's something I wish they would have like fixed or even modified just a little bit, but you know, it gives that original Call of Duty feel like it used to. What I love so much about this game, basically, is if you're an original Call of Duty player and have played most of the old Call of Duties, you will love this game like I said before. Um, it gives you that feeling that you're back in time basically and you can relive a lot of the same memories that you have before. It's something that most games don't get a second chance for and we're lucky to have. And one huge question that a lot of people are asking is will this lead to a remastered Modern Warfare 2? I myself am asking that same question and will be doing a ton of research on that and hoping they are doing that because Modern Warfare 2 in my opinion was one of the best Call of Duties ever. Um, a lot of the newer Call of Duties, are, I feel, are kind of like slapped together and just, you know, they don't have as much thought put into them as before. Modern Warfare 2, to me, was one of the greatest games I've ever played before. But there is a couple problems with the game, as goes with all Call of Duties. Campers are a huge, huge issue. This game, since it is boots on the ground, which I like personally better than jetpacks and stuff, but anyway, since it's boots on the ground, you do end up having a lot of campers, which kind of sucks because then if you walk around any corners, basically you have the one guy sitting in the one spot that everyone hates. And that kind of sucks, but you know, it does make the gameplay a little interesting since you are used to running around using jetpacks and flying for the most part recently. Overall, I think the game is awesome. Very, very good compared to the original, and it's basically the same thing. Um, if you guys are looking for that same experience as before, definitely go ahead and buy this game with Infinite Warfare, because I think it only does come with Infinite Warfare. If it doesn't, definitely just buy it by itself, because it is amazing, in my opinion. And like I was saying, I do hope they go and remaster some of the older Call of Duties too, before, just because they were awesome, and I'd love to be able to play those on the next-gen consoles. But that's it for today guys, thanks for watching, if you guys found this video helpful or even liked it, go ahead and leave a thumbs up, and if you really enjoyed it, go ahead and subscribe for more. Alright guys, this has been Brandon, and I'm out.